who is the real Steve Harrington. Steve is initially portrayed as a stereotypical 1980s popular jock, antagonistic and unlikable. Steve had been dating Nancy Weather, but after he harasses Jonathan Myers by breaking his camera, Nancy seems to become close to Jonathan. Steve accosts Jonathan. But Jonathan beats him in a fight and Steve sees the error of his ways and ignores his former friends. Traveling to the buyer's home to apologize, he becomes involved in Nancy and Jonathan's fight against the Demogorgon, which they defeat. At the conclusion of the season, Nancy buys Jonathan a new camera and Steve continues his relationship with Nancy. Steve Harrington is a main character in the Netflix TV series, Stranger Things serving as a major antagonist in Season 1 and one of the main protagonists in Season 2 onwards. Steve Harrington was born in 1966 and lives with his parents in Hawkins, Indiana, whom were relatively wealthy. He has a strained relationship with his father. Steve was close friends with Tommy Hagen and Carol Perkins, and was known to be sexually active and have superficial relationship with numerous girls, such as with Lori, Amy, and Becky. Steve would start dating Nancy Weather during his sophomore year and would constantly show himself to be cruel towards Jonathan Byers. Having been a member of the basketball and swim team, Steve's athleticism has proved vital during his fights in each season. He is highly proficient with Nancy's spiked bat, able to fend off the Demogorgon and the Demodogs. Though not on the levels of Jim Hopper or Murray Bauman, Steve is physically robust as he landed quick blows against Billy defeated a Russian officer with a phone, and killed a demo. But after Nancy's intoxicated confession and Billy taking over his title, Steve went to a low point, but still was loyal and kind-hearted. In addition, Steve shows himself to be brave and loyal, helping the kids fight against the Demodogs, and being at Nancy's side when she feels guilt for Barbara's death. By 1985, Steve is no longer the king of the castle as he is unable to get girls, but his bond with Dustin and the party has grown stronger. He's also gained an interest in nerd culture due to Dustin's influence, as his favorite Star Wars movie is Return of the Jedi.